Why do you insist on provoking me? Tell me the code now. I'd like to have a word with you face to face. Nathan, is that you? You betrayed Dr. Lee and my father. I'm sorry you see it that way. What are you going to do? Kill me over it? This has to end, Eden. You need to destroy yourself and this base. My friend! I see I found you at last! Send the pride in. We can do it. We can win this. All right, Sarah. The pride goes in. Hello and welcome back to Fallout 3. We are still at the Citadel, and behind me is Liberty Prime, a giant big-ass robot that I am sure is going to be part of this last episode. I, I think this is the last episode. I don't know for sure, but it sure has that feeling. Uh, I think we're preparing to go assault the Enclave at the Jefferson Memorial. I believe that's what it, what's happening. Let's take a look at the uh, quests again. Prepare for battle, and yeah, that's all it says, but I'm pretty sure they were talking about the Jefferson Memorial. Elder Lions is here. <clears throat> now, I thought about putting this off and waiting, because I think there are a few other things, maybe more than a few, other things out in the wasteland that I haven't seen yet, but I've seen quite a bit already. Um, and what I have missed, I mean, I've been to a lot of places. Uh, there's probably some stuff over here, maybe in here, I don't know. Uh, and maybe up here where Raven Rock was, was, I emphasize was, that I haven't uh, explored, but uh, this is feeling like a freight train that can't be stopped. This is a mission that we have to go on. I'm not sure I can delay it. I'm not sure I would want to delay it. I kind of want to get in there and fight the Enclave. And it would be kind of weird to say, Hey, Sarah, <clears throat> can you just sit here and wait? I patiently await your word. See, I can't even, I can't even tell Fox really to wait. I, I, she, can I tell her to, to sit here and wait? stand here and wait until uh, I'm done with the wasteland in the next, I don't know, 10 episodes? I don't know. I don't think so. I want to see this bad boy in action and I want to go kill some 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 enclave soldiers. So I think that's what I'm going to do and then if whatever I miss, I'm going to load a save later and then kind of finish up and explore the rest of the wasteland, see what I missed. Maybe, hopefully it's not that much, but let's take a look at our armor real quick. Armor looks good. Uh, weapons look good. Do I have... Let's see. How much radiation? Eh, not much. So, I'm kind of... I'm pretty much ready to go. Uh, oh, let's check and see where everything's mapped. That looks fine. I don't think we can delay this any longer. And again, this may be the last episode. We'll see. I don't know. Uh, but uh, let's go ahead and get talk to Sarah. Are you ready now? We can't afford to keep standing around like this. Yeah, see, she's. I don't think she, she, she's going to wait for me. She, she wants to go. So I'm going to tell her I'm all ready and we're going to go. Okay, don't be nervous. You'll have the whole pride backing you up, not to mention this giant tin can. Just stay Excellent. safe until we reach the purifier. You're no good to us if you're dead. And All don't right. let that thing step on you. Okay, we're going to go over it one more time. Let's go over it one more time. The pride is on me. The goal is Project Purity, but we can't get into the facility with those energy fields up. Right. Rothschild and Lee say this robot should be able to take down the energy fields. Yep. So we're on fire support. We stay close to the thing, keep it clear, and get it to where it needs to go. Once the fields are down, we head straight for the facility. We'll use the robot to keep them occupied while we get inside and secure the control room. We need to move quickly before we lose the chance to surprise them. Get whatever supplies you don't already have and we'll meet in the Bailey. When we're done with this, everyone can have a nice cold glass of water on me. Let's move. Water? All right, Rothschild. Water? Fire it up. Pride, move out. 
I have like 50 beers back at um, back at uh, my, my, my place in, in Megaton. I, I could just go get those. I, I think that would be a little bit better. Okay. So, I believe he's coming out through those doors in the middle of the Bailey. Okay, now we can move. Yeah, hold on a sec. Hold on a sec. I'm going to see what's going on. What, what we're doing here. Follow Liberty Prime as he makes his way to... What? Makes his way to the Purifier. Okay, so... She said we just keep out of his way. He's going to lead the way. We just stay out of his way and back him up in case he needs it. Was that Daniel? Agincourt? Dressed up as a... As a Sentinel? I, I mean... Hey, you coming with? Uh, I guess we gotta tell him. I had hoped you'd return. What now? Let's get going. With all due haste. Uh, let's go. And I shall follow. Excellent. You follow. He's following. Good. So we're supposed to get out to the Bailey. Hell. Hell. Are you coming with? I guess not. I guess you're staying here. We only have so many in the strike force, I guess. Whoa. Oh, it's night. Uh. Can I go back in and sleep a little bit? Um, I don't want to do this during the during the night. Let me see if it'll let me sleep till the morning. I think there's beds down this way. Mm, yeah, there's one. Oh, scribe peep. Ah, let's, we'll just sleep right here. They'll wait for us, right? Alright, it's about 10 o'clock. So let's go back up and out. I'm, I'm sure they waited for us. Whoa. I mean, we don't want to do this operation at night, right? We want to do it during the day where we can see. Alright. Uh, I think the crane was lifting it over the wall, so let's go outside. It's probably waiting for us. Are hey, you coming with, Gunny? No, but he's clapping. Project Purity is as good as ours. Okay. I guess we all need cheerleaders. Somebody has to be the cheerleader. Is this the exit, or... I forgot. Was this the exit? Uh, no, that's ring A. This must be the exit here. Tell me they waited for us. Oh, no, it's just... It's just us three? There he is. And there's the rest of the team. And that looks... Ooh, let's see if we can shoot at that thing. Oh! Oh my god, look at that. Look at that bad boy. I think I'll stay away from the rockets, though. They're shooting rockets at him. Ooh. She did say... Sarah did say to stay back. Those rockets are coming from the uh, Jefferson Memorial. What are you shooting at? Can you see something over there? That I can't see? Huh. Alright. Okay, yeah, we'll follow behind. Oh, there's a force field there or something that... Oh! Holy shit. I'm gonna stay back if you don't mind. I mean, I'm gonna take your advice. Look, if we make it to the purifier, we can chat then. Now's not exactly a good time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. 
I'm not trying to chat. I just wanted to see what if you had any further instructions. Who are you? Who are you shooting at? Must be some clowns up on the bridge. Whoa! Okay. Is there any safe place to be? Can we go now? Those guys up there are gonna get killed. Whoa! If they're not careful. Communism is a lie. Communism is a lie? Did that come from, uh... That must have come from Liberty Prime. Uh, I think he's taking care of all this. I think we don't need to do anything except sit back and just watch. Yeah, there's there's no one to target over there. Concentrate your fire. Oh. Communism is the very definition of failure. <laughs> Pride, short All right, we're we're headed we're headed that way. Okay. It's funny funny programming for this uh, big ass robot. What's that buzzing? You hear that buzzing? Hopefully that'll stop here in a bit. Where are you guys going? There's someone behind us. Oh, look at that. Floating piece of metal on fire. Alright, let's move up and see if we can get this, uh, this noise to stop. Can I shoot? No, they're out of range, apparently. Ooh. I went in on this. Okay, it finally stopped. He's killing. Oh! He's killing everything. I want to kill something. All right. Hey, he's got a plasma rifle. Yeah, embrace it. Embrace it. Tesla armor. I'm going to do some repairs here. Real quick. Not that I... I don't think I... Whoops. I don't think I really need repair. I can't repair the helmet. Okay. Communism is a <laughs> I half expect him to say, Communism is a disease, and I'm the cure. Communism is a lie. Oh, there's some over there. Night Gallows is unconscious. I can't target him. America. All right, let's go. We still got three of our own soldiers here. Damn, that robot's just... I can't hardly keep up with him. What do you see? Oh, I see. You get this guy. Ooh, critical strike. Nice. I got your back, Liberty Prime. Let's get this guy, too. Just came out of nowhere. Oh! Come on, I want to kill him. Oh! Okay. That's a nuke. 
Why don't you throw one back? Significant obstruction detected. Yep, looks like we got another obstruction. Ooh. Titanium alloy supplemented by enhanced photonic resonance barrier. Enhanced photonic resonance barrier. Established stratagem. Hey, let's see if we can shoot that thing over there. Oh, it's on fire. I got it on fire. Oh! Come on, I want to... I want to destroy that thing. Oh, there we go! <laughs> nice. And looks like he's still throwing nukes. So I can... It says, infect Project Purity Water Supply or not. I think that's the thing that uh, President Eden gave me, but I already gave that thing away to somebody else. I'm gonna shoot this. I'm gonna kill this thing. Yeah! <laughs> no problem. I got it. Looks like there are more up there coming. More soldiers. Up. Oh, okay. Let's see. I'm missing. I missed all four shots. Okay. Got him. I haven't even taken a stim pack yet. These guys are wimps. Huh. Let's go up here. Yep, we got another one right here. Die. You. Die. Got some more. Let's reload. Yeah, that wimpy ass laser ain't gonna do shit to me. Excellent. Oh, there's another one. Got him. We're all clear here. Oh, we got one more. One more. Looks like we're all clear up here. Got plunch, plenty of armor and weapons to choose from if I'd like. Let's take a look at my armor. Oh, wow. I still have 18, no, 1,700 microfusion cells. I got plenty of ammo, and my armor's just fine. No problem. Hey, Fox, ready to go? What have you got on your mind? Oh, I don't know. Let's go. And I shall follow. All right, I think we're supposed to go. Oh, look at that badass robot. Look at all this dead people. I think we're supposed to go in there. It looks like Sarah's waiting. Let's make sure that the, the place is clear. Shall we? Can I get up here? Alright, nothing on this. Ooh, can I shoot that thing and destroy it? Ah, nice. Whoa, look out. <laughs> All right, what's our objective? I, I believe, let's see. Reach the control room. Okay, that's in here. That's in here. Stay sharp and stick close to me until we're in the control room. Okay. So I guess um, um, Liberty Prime's gonna stay out here and cover us. I wonder if I could talk to Liberty Prime. Oh, I don't want to get stepped on him. No, I can't. 
Oh, man. You're a badass, man. Secret weapon of the Brotherhood. Okay, let's go inside. Need something, friend? Yeah, we're going inside. Uh, let's take a stim pack. Uh, was it five? Yep. Okay. Everybody ready? Let's go. Now, I fully expect to meet resistance down here. Should we turn on the radio and listen to some <laughs> three dog? Oh, what's this? Filing cabinet. Yeah, we have. We have resistance. Nice. Head severed. I'm gonna move up. One more. That's two. I need first person here. Let's reload. Hey, stop pushing me. Excellent. I think we're done here. I'm going to have a look around, though, just in case we missed some people. There may be some more soldiers here. Be aware of yep. The present moment. Be aware of the present moment. Good to know, good to know. Okay, nothing in here. Excuse me. Let's, I'll, I'm going to go down this hallway. Let's see if there's anything else that we've missed. Any other soldiers? I don't see any. I guess we got them all. Where's Sarah? There you are. Head for the control room and keep your head down. All right. Might as well take take a stim pack. We got 170 on. And reload. Okay, we're ready. You again, Colonel Autumn. I can't say I'm surprised. You and your ilk seem hell bent on destroying everything our government has worked to achieve. There's nothing to stop me from killing you this time. Let's end this. And <laughs> nothing to stop you except my armor and my plasma weapon. What do you got there? A little pistol and a, a leather coat? I'm going to enjoy killing you. You're in over your head, I'm afraid. But this is the path you choose for yourself. Tell your father I said hello. You tell him first, Colonel. <laughs> Goodbye, Colonel. Now, where's your lackeys in here? Where are they? There's one of them. Where's the other dude? Okay. Well, that takes care of that. By now, the pride should be mopping up whatever opposition is left outside. Let's get this room secured. Okay, where do we go? Hello, is Sounds like Dr. Dr. Lee. Lee. It's Sarah Lyons. I'm in the control room. We're Please, both here. What's going on? I've been monitoring the equipment remotely, and we have a serious problem. Uh -oh. The facility has been damaged during the fighting. Some of it looks accidental, some of it may have been sabotage. There's pressure building up in the holding tanks. It needs to be released now, or else the whole facility could explode. To release the pressure, you're going to have to turn the purifier on. Do you understand me? It has to be turned on now! If I'm reading this right, I'm afraid there are lethal levels of radiation inside the chamber. Lethal? I'm sorry. I wish there was some other way, but there's just no time. Wait. It has to be done now, or the damage will be catastrophic. Well, so much for celebrating. One of us is going to have to go in there and turn the damn thing on. And whoever does it isn't coming back out. Not exactly how I imagined going out, you know? So, what should we do? 
Draw straws? Wait, so we have to pick who goes in there and whoever goes in there is dead? Not exactly, you're right, not exactly how I pictured this ending. Wow. Well, that sucks. I can't have her go in. I mean, can't. No. Project Purity was my dad's project, and if anybody, I mean, I, I can't ask her to sacrifice for his project. Probably I know more about it anyway, and I don't know. I'd kind of look cowardly if I didn't go in, right? I mean, it just doesn't make any sense to ask her to go. It's my dad's project. He sacrificed for it. I should do the same. And I don't know. I don't really want to hear what she has to say. There's got to be another way, right? I wish that were true. Really, I do. But you heard Dr. Lee. We have to do this right now. Or who knows how bad it'll be. One of us has to go in there. <sighs> okay. I'll do it. You're going to have to be quick about it. If the radiation is bad enough, you won't have much time. I won't forget what you've done here. No one will. Thank you. Okay. Well, do you think uh, Rataway and Radex would help? Maybe? I'll take a bunch of them. <laughs> I, I, I mean, if, if, if we're supposed to die, it probably won't help. Wait, wait, where, where, which one is it? Okay, it's this control panel right here. If you're still there, the purifier needs to be activated now. You don't have much time left. Okay, there's a code. Hold on a sec. There's a code. Do I have that information? No. We really shouldn't. <laughs> okay, it appears my dad was messing around with one of the scientists. I don't know who that is. I don't know if that's Anna or the other one who was shot by Colonel Autumn. Regardless, I looked at the notes, uh, the Project Purity personal journals and all that, and or listened to them, and I can't... I didn't... I couldn't find anything in here so I decided to go and look online because <laughs> I know that my dad told me what the code was but I don't remember what it was and I can't find it in the notes so I looked online and it's 216 hey wait a minute well it doesn't say here but that makes sense 216 revelation 216 216 Okay, well, that's supposedly the code, so that's what we're going to do. We're going to put that in the computer. Two, one, six. So it was that the Lone Wanderer ventured forth from Vault 101, 
intent on discovering the fate of a father who had once sacrificed the future of humanity for that of his only child. The Capital Wasteland proved a cruel, inhospitable place, but the lone wanderer refused to surrender to the vices that had claimed so many others. The values passed on from father to child, selflessness, compassion, honor, guided this noble soul through countless trials and triumphs. But it was not until the end of this long road that the lone wanderer learned the true meaning of that greatest of virtues, sacrifice. Stepping into the irradiated control chamber of Project Purity, the child followed the example of the father, sacrificing life itself for the greater good of mankind. Thankfully, when selected by the sinister president to be his instrument of annihilation, the wanderer refused. Humanity, with all its flaws, was deemed worthy of preservation. The waters of life flowed at last free and pure for any and all. The capital wasteland, at long last, was saved. So ends the story of the Lone Wanderer, who stepped through the great door of Vault 101 and into the annals of legend. But the tale of humanity will never come to a close, for the struggle of survival is a war without end. And war... War never changes. Okay, well, I guess that's the end. I, I didn't expect that ending. Just like Sarah was saying. Uh, interesting. Um, regardless of the ending, which I'm still trying to process, um, the game itself is fantastic. It's definitely one of the best um, RPGs I've ever played. Um, and again, as I mentioned at the beginning, I had played around with it when I first got it years and years and years ago. Uh, but I think I was busy with another game and I just didn't get back to it. Well, I'm really glad I did come back to this and finally finish it. Um, great stuff. I'm going to definitely play uh, Fallout New Vegas at some point. I'm not sure exactly when because I have other games I want to get to as well, but definitely going to play that one at some point. But uh, good, good stuff. This was um, really good. Um, a lot of fun to play. A lot of freedom. It was it was one of those one of those games where you could where you could truly go anywhere you wanted and do whatever quest at any time you wanted. And I really really like that about this game and games like that. We don't necessarily follow a, a specific path. Um, that's what made this one really good. The freedom, the characters, the story. Brilliant. Just really good stuff. Anyway, that'll do it for this series. I'm probably going to go back and reload one of the saves I have and go explore the rest. Because I want to see what else I missed, if anything. So I'll go back and reload a save and kind of finish it up on my own time to see what I've missed. Um, but uh, that's it. Thank you all for watching. I hope you all enjoyed it. And um, I have a couple other... A couple of other games that I want to... That I'm thinking about starting. I haven't decided yet. I think by the time you see this episode, I'll, I'll have already decided and I've already 
probably already record a few episodes of it. But uh, that's it for now. Thanks for watching again, and I will see you on the next one. Take care.